Hello everyone, today let's look at school lunches here in Japan. So the following photos are taken from my four elementary schools, taken from October through December. Do note that the menu does change depending on the time of year as they will use seasonal ingredients and dishes. Um, but let's get right into it. You will quickly notice a pattern of what is served for school lunch. Some staples that you can always expect are milk and a type of soup. Usually the carbohydrate is rice. Sometimes it's bread or noodles. Typically there is a vegetable side and a protein main. Occasionally there will be a seasonal dessert such as fruit. For example, you will sometimes see cherries, grapes, and melons in the summer, and oranges, apples, and pears in the winter. Each kyushoku is around 650 to 700 kilocalories if you get served the calculated portion size. Some of the photos you will see I've been given omori or an excess of certain dishes, in which case the calorie count will be substantially higher. The tea lady and the other staff who distribute the lunch at most of my schools know that I can eat a lot, and when there is any extra left after portioning for everyone else, they are extremely kind and put the excess onto my tray. So normally I would receive this tray in the teacher's room and the food is saran wrapped to keep it warm. I then get called by my students to eat with them and I would rotate around the different classes and grade levels. I highly value this one-on-one -on -one time with the children, as teaching large classes I don't really get to know them well. It's especially heartwarming when they cheer, clap, and are super excited for you to be there, and it makes you feel part of the school and community. In classrooms, children will often arrange the desks to face one another in groups of four or long rows of around eight, which promotes conversation like in traditional households. Some of the children are responsible for collecting the food from the lunch preparation room and distributing it among their peers. They are the day's kyushuk toban and wear white masks, smocks, and a hat while performing their duties. Once finished eating, each child is responsible for cleaning up their own tray and dishes, and the kyushuk toban then return everything to the lunchroom. Don't forget to say your thanks for the wonderful meal by saying itadakimasu before and gochisou sama deshita afterwards. Having school lunches is one of the best parts of the school systems here. For children to receive nutritionally balanced diets and a wide range of cuisines from an early age is a good way for them to stay healthy and to try something new. It also helps that everyone receives the same meal, so there are no children that get discriminated for what they have brought to school. Families are grateful that there is an affordable option for their children and don't have to worry about preparing a lunch for them in the morning. Of course, there are some days in the year in which children bring a packed lunch or bento, and from talking with the children, they are split on which they prefer, kyushoku or bento. At my schools, Kyushoku costs 239 yen per lunch. This varies by district within the city or town, so it differs all across Japan. From what I've heard from colleagues, this only covers the cost of the ingredients, and the cost of labor is paid through the government, which is why the cost of each meal is so low. It's unbelievable when you consider that a medium-sized fries at McDonald's will already set you back 270 yen. Currently, I receive these Kyushoku bills at each of my schools, usually added up after several months, insert the money into an envelope, and return it to the teacher in charge of collecting the money. Although I've heard that this system of payment may change in Sendai, and also varies by school. I honestly feel super grateful to have schools that make kyushoku within the schools themselves. I know that some schools have kyushoku made in centers and then delivered, and I've heard that the quality can be substantially lower. Um, and for 239 yen per meal, it's the best value you'll get for quality and quantity. Um, and it's definitely one of the things I look forward to every single day as a teacher here in Japan. For all you prospective ALTs out there, and for anyone who's just interested in seeing what they serve at school lunches here in Japan, I hope you found this video to be helpful. Thank you guys always for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.